New developments tonight in the search for two suspects in a shooting and home invasion. Two men wanted for Saturday's shooting that's left a Hendersonville woman in critical condition are caught on camera. Police released that video just hours ago, hoping someone can identify the armed and dangerous men. Very little steps to conceal their identity. Police say the two men captured on this surveillance video are the suspects in Saturday's shooting during a home invasion in Hendersonville. This kind of is a little bit more verifiable. Lieutenant Chris Leroy just returned from the SBI crime lab in Raleigh, where detectives were able to retrieve images from the home security system. It's in video format that's a little bit more concrete than what an eyewitness may, may give us, from, especially an eyewitness that's going through this kind of... Incident. The shooting victim, Tasha Clayton, leaves the back of the home with one of the suspects. Police say that's when the taller of the two men shot her once in the head off camera in the backyard. Because of the way the, do the animals are acting here, he's walking back up to the house. He's then seen going back into the home. Police say there was a scuffle inside, which agitated the dogs. Homeowner Michael Peake was hit in the head and held at gunpoint. The second suspect in the blue shirt then goes to the backyard, grabs a shovel, and starts digging beneath one of the dog houses. Police aren't certain what he was digging for. You'll see the uh, victim without a shirt come running out of the door being followed by one of the other suspects. That's when Peek escaped the home and ran. The two suspects are last seen running across the back of the property. Police are hoping someone can identify these two armed men. I would think that if anybody knows who our suspects are, they would be able to pick them out off this video. Investigators say these men are considered armed and dangerous. They ask anyone who can identify them to call Hendersonville Police.